Hello, dude bros of the internet. <clears throat> I'm going to be teaching you how to make a terrarium. So you're going to want to grab a mason jar. Mine isn't actually mason brand, but that doesn't matter. You just grab a jar with one of the lids that are that you can screw on. <laughs> I don't know. And then you're gonna wanna grab some plants that are very slow growers. Like I got these, I like, I don't even know, like ferns or something. They're super tiny. And you're gonna need dirt as well. And that's pretty much it. So, let us go on a hunt to find all that we need. So we have our plants right here in our jar here. And the only thing we, else that we need is dirt. So I'm going to go get that right now. Okay guys, so I'm outside. That's why it's all dark. Because it's nighttime and I have a flashlight. So, shadows. Um, you're going to want to get enough dirt to fill up your mason jar to about here. Okay guys, so my dad just dug up a plant right here. Or he planted a plant. So there's a bunch of dirt from really deep. Right around here, so I'm just gonna grab some. See, this is nice, nice dirt. And I'm gonna fill up my mason jar. Okay, so you're gonna wanna put your best plant or your biggest plants in the back. Not in the very back, though. Then Line your little, your smaller plants right near, them. right near the one in the back. So there, that one looks nice. That one looks nice. So it should look something like that. Now, if one of them is sticking up too much, you can kind of level it out. But if you want, you can actually even put decorations in. Such as Christmas stuff. Pretty much you can add whatever you want. Okay guys, so you can pick whatever theme you want to make yours. You could do, you could even do like a war theme. Put little barbed wire designs in the back. And put like bullet shells. But my personal theme, I just want to do nature. So you're going to want to get a big rock. Put it right there in the back. Like so. Then you want to grab some pe pebbles. And you don't want to sprinkle them all throughout the area. But you're going to want to find an area where the ground is the lowest. Um, and sprinkle some rocks there. Okay, so I washed my rock off. It's pretty clean-ish. And you're going to want to put its worst looking side in the back. So that it looks pretty good on the front. And if your rocks are kind of falling more towards the middle, more than you want them to, you can kind of scrape them back. And there you go, your terrarium is almost completely finished. Once you have completed all my steps, the only two things you need to do is put water in it and clean out the sides of the jar. And that is your terrarium done. With rocks, plants, completely finished. Thanks for watching. I honestly don't care if you like and subscribe. Bye.